so I think um, food basically reflects who we are and the influences in our life. So for example, you know, I grew up Chinese American, but um, so I had a Chinese kitchen at home, but I also had a lot of American influences. I've been to Peru. I have a good friend who's Korean who taught me how to cook a whole bunch of Korean dishes. I had a boyfriend who was Thai who taught me a bunch of Thai dishes. He's gone, but the recipes still exist. Unfortunately, because we just got back from Turkey, we have no fresh produce. We threw everything out before we left. So basically, it's dried fruit. I went to the Patel Brothers and I bought a bunch of 99 cent like uh, microwavable, I guess, Indian entrees. And then we also have Korean takeout. I don't like cheese, but there's one brand of cheese, one kind of cheese I like, which is Parmesan Reggiano. I don't even know how to pronounce it. And I have actually no idea where this comes from. We have a um, I can't even pronounce it, but it's this kind of um, champagne. And then we have Vermont maple syrup. And oh, I love this mint chutney. <laughs> we have hoisin sauce. We have chili sauce. Oh my God, I have no idea where this came from, but someone obviously gave it to me. It's ginger syrup and you put it over um, the apple pears. I don't know if you guys know apple pears. They're like Chinese, Asian pears. They're like apples, but they're like pears at the same time. And if you, you just slice it and put that over, people really, really like it.